Okay, so if you're wanting to work in ABS plastic, and this is about two millimeter thick, you might find that you wanna create a sort of bending profile like this on one of your pieces you're working on it. So if we draw a sort of profile like this, and we can either try and fit the piece of plastic using a heat gun, and the trick is to keep it moving all the time, like so, And so you see how I'm going to keep turning it, like so, and that'll give you a good even heating. Don't let it stay in one spot. So we take that and we can now bend it into the shape that we want. And obviously it's going to be quite hot. You tend to get a bit asbestos fingers from doing this, but be careful. And so again, this is just for sort of sketch modeling. And if you wanted to create a shape like that, that would be absolutely fine. However, if you didn't have a heat gun or you felt that it's a little bit too uh, difficult to get a delicate shape because it does get soft quite quickly and then it sets quite quickly, you could basically continue to use the sort of score and snap technique that I mentioned earlier and you could go along scoring the plastic like so and then basically bending it gently and you can see we're creating a curved profile. Now it doesn't matter if it actually breaks because you could always just glue it on again but if we're happy with that, for say that part of the curve, then it means lower down we can, we can go from the other side. And keep doing the same. It doesn't require much force. And of course you can take your time. And of course you don't have to do perpendicular 90 degree joins like that. You could have them any angle and make all sorts of shapes. So we can see that with a little bit of encouragement we get it to, to fix onto there as well. So you could glue that on however you like it. And so we've got two variations on how you'd make a bend in plastic.